The Hate You Give could be about nearly any black teen that was shot by police during a routine stop that's happened in the past two or three years. The parallels are clear because it happens too frequently. It gives readers a better sense of the rest of the story, the parts left out of social media and the regular media. This is a powerful book that cuts straight to the issues behind police use of deadly force against black people, particularly black young men. Written from the perspective of a teen black girl who witnesses her friend get shot, The Hate You Give by Angie Thomas deals with her own bias, the heavy bias of her white friend, the unintended bias of her white boyfriend, confusion over having a police officer as an uncle, and the shame she feels for living in two different worlds. I love the powerful character development, strong, plot-driven home life, and conversations balanced with realistic events. The book is divided into three sections, before the event, after the event, and the countdown. I think the author did a great job placing the main character between her home world, Garden Heights, a primarily black neighborhood, and her school world, the prep school her parents put her in to help her get ahead in life. Without this, it would not have felt nearly as natural for the main character to hear as many personal thoughts of people from so many different backgrounds. CT students and staff can check out The Hate You Give and other books from my book talks in the ARC library. Not a CTC student? Check with your local public library.